So, where was I? All right. Already done that one. Those horses really don't look very well. Uh, I guess we can try that one. But I really like mazes. When I said I like mazes, I was lying. I hate mazes. Oh, this doesn't look too bad, though. Make sure to... Oh! Okay. So there's a maze on each side. Um... This is very squiggly. Doesn't look too bad, as long as we avoid the areas that go into the squiggles. It shouldn't be too hard to work out a path. We start here. I think we have to get that, I would assume so. But... I mean, we can... Okay, there's a hole to the edge, and there's this wall completely blocking this entire area off. The only way to get to that is through here. So, I'm guessing if we go off the edge, how do you... Oh, but no. No, I want to go up. No, I want to go up. I no, 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 I want to go up. I, 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 so this is how i got to control this thing. Can I just click on the blue thing and... Okay, that is so much easier. Oh, whoa, 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 oh, I'm everywhere. Okay. This shouldn't be too bad, so... Let's find an opening. And try to see what happens when we go to another face. If I got this right, then that would mean that... There's a maze on each side, we have to find a way to get to that jewel. Okay, there is, so we have to move along this entire maze. We can't even see five-sixths of the maze at any one time. So we can only see one-sixth of it. We have to keep in mind where we are orientated. Wait a minute. If we have to keep in mind where we're orientated, hang on. Okay, if I go up, I should be back at the front face, the, where we started. Because I went down, and I went left, and if I go up again, I should be able... I mean, three-dimensionally speaking, I would be right back where I was. I, I need to see something. Okay, please, no. No, don't go that way. Come on. Come on. Follow my cursor. Or better yet, bring dynamite and break the walls. This should bring us back to the front, and, oh no, look, this is the same jewel, but it's nowhere near where we were before. Look, this is the same face, but rotated, which means, depending on how we move through this puzzle, through this maze, we will get different orientations of the same face. It is very easy to get confused and lost in this maze. Oh. Wow, we're going to need to, um, yeah, <laughs> okay, so, maybe the oracle, I mean, I hope, to have something interesting to say. Pursue what path you may, so long as your endeavor leads you to wisdom. All journeys toward understanding begin at the same place. Although many may follow the one true way, only few may comprehend the path to Mahiman. 
All right, the best tidbit I got from all that is, this is puzzles called Path to Mahiman. Okay, so let's restart and try this again. I'm gonna just keep going up under the condition that I can't screw up the orientation of this cube if I'm only going in um, one direction. I won't end up rope like if I go go north all the time eventually if I end up back at the original face I would be right where I started so I'll be able to look through every face or at least four of the six faces easily if I can keep going north that is. It looks like I can hmm that north area up there I'm going to have to trace around and find a way in. So, hopefully it's accessible. Um, go this way, this way. Let me, uh, let me trace the wall. Uh, okay, there is a hole in the wall which leads there, that's not helpful, but down there, oh, that's right where I was, wow. Sometimes it's useful to trace the wall, that tells you if you've hit a uh, point that you can't, there's another one, there, there's another one, there's, there's more than, there's more than one, there, there's more than, there, there's more than, there's, there's, there's more, I, 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 I don't want to live on this planet anymore. Solving this puzzle took quite some time, and since I'm sitting down, I'm not about to use a chalkboard anytime soon. Instead, I'm going to use my badly constructed cube. This cube took a while to make. Basically, I went through every side of the maze, um, looked at every uh, connecting point from one face to another, and decided which faces are accessible uh, from a certain point. For example, here, um, if you're here, you can move here or here, but you can't reach these two. Only these two are connected to each other. The idea was to try and create an entire rough overview of which faces connect to which faces, and then from there, solve two puzzles. One, how to reach all the jewels. In this case, there are a total of two. In terms of which faces to go through. And when we're actually on the face, it's just a basic maze solve, which is relatively easy. It just takes practice to get an idea of how to move, um, or because there's a lot of confusing, especially with this puzzle in particular. There's so many little squiggly things that just go into dead ends and it's easy to get tunnel vision and not realize there's a path somewhere. So that is a little bit annoying, but we can mitigate that by at least knowing what our goals are for each face. Okay, so I'm on this face. I know that I have to go through this exit on this face um, because that's part of the path that will get me to the jewel. And another thing I've noticed um, when I was tracing out the walls is that if there's no hole in a wall, there's no way to get to the other side from that same face. So for example, on the very front, the entire left side is completely closed off in the very beginning because you can only access the left side from uh, the openings on the bottom and the left and the top that are on the far left side. And another thing that I like about this cube is that as we're moving, I can move the cube in the direction we're going, which means if we go something like this, 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 I'm back on the front face, but the orientation's different. In the game, it's actually gonna confuse you. It's easy to be like, oh, I've never been here before. Wait, no, this is the same face, only now it's orientated differently. By, by turning this, this cube, every time I make a move in the game, it becomes much easier to keep track of where I am. So, with that being said, I'm going to set up an easier view of this cube and go through a path that will reach both jewels. Here's the front. 
the jewel was circled in blue. The only way to reach that jewel is to come from the east face. So let's take a look at the east face here. Now that, uh, the red lines represent uh, walls. They represent things that we can't get past on that face. They're really more for my health when I was building this, following the black lines. So the only way to reach that side is if we follow the black line, we can reach it from the north face. There's a little loop around, which goes back to the east face. Now from there it splits off into two. We're now on the back face. Um, and we notice that there's three on this, there's three ways to get to the back face. It might look like there's only two, but there, um, there, there are three. There's one at the very, very bottom. The one in the middle takes us to another jewel. So thankfully, the first jewel we have to get to, the path to that jewel is on the path of the other jewel, so that works out. But if we want to actually get there, if we take the top down to the bottom, go back to the east, we'll now have to go to the south. From the south, there's only one path we can take that'll lead us to this face. On the back again, so this breaks off in two branches. Let's try going this way. This brings us to the west. There's a little squiggly path that will bring us to the north. Um, and this is close to the front, I believe. If we go down, all right, we're back at the front. We're at the start. So if we go from that start, go up, and then reverse our path, we should be able to do this. All right. Our first move will be to go north. Next, we're going to want to go to the left from here. All right. All paths are kind of squiggly, even if they were straight, so the squiggly on the cube there just indicates that this is even squigglier than the other squigglies that we have to squiggle through. I also found I really like that word. Alright, we're going to ignore the north past path and we're going to go left. See, so you get tricked by these squiggles. No, 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 don't want to go in the S. Okay. It's really only one way we can go, so that's going to be going up. Um, there is a way up. <laughs> I know there is. Okay, there we go. You kind of just have to brute force your way through these things. We want to take this side here, not the one on the left, but this, the right one. Oh, whoops, just jumped up. But yeah, because the other one will allow, force us to have to go left on this side, but we don't want to go left on this side. We want to go right on this side. And now we're at that little loop around where the first jewel is. So let's go up here. Round, 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 round. And then we're going to... Actually, wait. Hold on, future me. Um, yeah, it looks like you can reach the jewel from here, but you can't. Uh, that thing goes down. All right, now we go. We want to reach the jewel from the bottom, the middle section, which is basically the one at the bottom, but that's higher than the other one, because the other one is the one we came in from. And with that, there should be a path here to get this jewel. The actual construction of this cube, going through this took some time, but bing. Uh, but in the end, it was well worth it. <laughs> um, I found the puzzle just trying to construct the cube. So that's one way you could approach this. Lots and lots of squiggles. This is the most convoluted way to go north. All that just so we can go south again. 
Well, at least this path is simple. And we are at the end. Once we move to the left, we reach the original face with the original jewel that we saw in the beginning. And we should be able to grab that jewel. I'm not even gonna let the sound effect finish. Okay. That took some time, but it was fun. The coloring in the background looks weird here. We are pros at this. We know this path like the back of our hands. Let's go up slowly, slowly, quickly. Let's do this. You got all that, Twilight? How come you never talk? No matter how much I talk to you, you never... <sighs> Go away. <laughs> 